Well, it's nearly quarter to four in the morning. Let's get this show on the road. Welcome to Froggy V. I'm Soph, this is Froggy, and we're travelling across the UK in a big green car to find fun things to do along the GridServe network. Unlike most other networks, each charger is numbered sequentially, so we have a route to follow. Each site will be visited in order, and we'll use as many chargers as we can to tick off our list. Today, we're going to Braintree in Essex, where we'll find charger number one. Wish us luck! But first, a quick stop at Kiel Services to top up the car. Good morning, Froggy. Let's get moving. At least you can see me now. Yes, we can actually start the video. Right. Let's go. We have to charge every 100 miles, so the next one is Watford Gap Services. Let's go charge a car. There's a lovely green car over there. He must be a super cool person. Right, so let's find a way out of here. And away. Oof. Here we go. Hello, Sophie. Look at that, there it is! Over there! I'm pointing but I'm not in the camera's view. You can see it though. Grid serve electric forecourt. We made it! Woo -hoo! I see number one, it is not taken up. So let's go around and claim our charger. Oh grief! I saw the 3D markings and I panicked. I thought they were like raised or something. Look at that. Ugh. Smash. Oop, oop. Up to 90 kilowatts. We made it. Made it. Woo. Was it worth six hours drive? Probably not. But we made it. Right. I'm going to need a coat. <coughs> so that's charger one. We have successfully charged from their first numbered charger. Although I didn't mean to get 80% charge, because it's a 90 kilowatt charger, it did charge pretty fast while I was inside there. So yeah, I had my mocha charging while looking at a mocha whilst drinking the mocha. Room 
Braintree Museum is holding a Lego exhibition and we had to go to it. Yes, I found, I found all 24 chargers that are here. And then you've got this sole 360 kilowatt charger. Why segregate one charger for the sake of 10 kilowatt extra? It's very peculiar. And worse than that, it doesn't have a number on, so I can't even count it at the pot this moment. It's got a queue now. Um, yeah. I don't know why they need that extra 10 kilowatts. Good for them, I guess. Today's main activity is pygmy goat pilates.
you're going to get trampled by goats, bring a spare t-shirt. Absolutely wrecked. <laughs> but that was so much fun. Oh dear. I, I mean, I, I used muscles that I didn't know existed. I'm pretty sure I pulled something during the event. But those goats are lovely. There's... I did my best. I did get to quite a lot of the Pilates session. But there was so much going on. Half the people in there were just laughing their heads off constantly. It was just bonkers. I've never done anything like that. <sighs> Clean t-shirt. Maybe I should have bought two t-shirts. Yeah, heal quickly, but they tend to jump off you after stabbing you, and then slide down, sort of skip off you, and it'll take take your skin off. So I'll be definitely up for a bath when I get back. But that was awesome. Goats, 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 goats. I ain't afraid of no goats. And we survived. Everyone survived. Let's do this. Charge number three, here we go. I was gonna honk my horn then to thank them, but that might have scared all the alpacas and maybe some of the goats. So thank goodness I didn't do that. And with that, we've completed three charges. Thank you all for watching, and we hope to see you again on our next adventure. Goodbye!